So this is a, we're obviously biased. This is a, maybe a, a harder question for us to answer, but what do you, what do people say about Lipsy Solar? I mean, I think that the, the thing that I would start with is that we listen and we get to know a practice, we diagnose, if you will, before we prescribe. I'd say that's, that's probably the number one principle that we operate on when we first meet a practice is we can't tell you what to do if we don't know who you are, what your goals are, you know, how long have you been in business, what do you have in place already? There is no magic pill in marketing. So I think that's probably one of the things that we hear first is that, oh, you listened to us, you got to know us. What, what else do um, what else do people most commonly say about about us? Well, I'd say one of the benefits of listening is that you learn a lot, and uh, over time you get a chance to learn a lot about a particular thing. And we've been listening for the last twenty years specifically to people who do what you do, and I don't just mean run clinical practices. I mean run eye care practices, laser eye surgery, cataract surgery, all sorts of ophthalmology practices. And when when you're able to listen to people for that long and the specific problems keep bubbling up again and again and again, well, that's in part what makes you qualified to prescribe any kind of advice. Because if you don't know what problems look like or how they manifest and how to solve them in the past based on trial and error, well, um, you can't really claim yourself as an expert in anything, right? So that's one thing that I would definitely say is as a consequence of listening, people yeah. often consider us experts. Yeah, yeah, and I think that listening where that listening took us is we worked with a number of practices and we started to see trends. And so that listening allowed us to create a very structured approach to working with practices. So we've developed a blueprint for, you know, what does a funnel look like for an ideal clinic? And looking through that lens at a clinic allows that recipient to really see, oh, okay, you know, I'm really, really good at closing people at the consultation. I'm very, very good medically. But actually, it turns out that while I have this amazing value, I'm, you know, for example, paying a lot of money, getting people to my website, and they all take off. Like, like nothing, nothing's happening. I'm spending all this money in marketing. I'm kind of spinning my wheels. I can't get traction. So having that blueprint allows us to, to put on these glasses and look at a practice and have a structured approach to say, okay, here's, here's your pinpointed problems and this is where the money is escaping your practice, escaping your business. I think that structure is really things, uh, something that people often tell us they really appreciate. Yeah, definitely. And I think that one of the things that we've been able to apply that structure in is across a wide variety of different practices across the world. So that's another thing I would say definitely that people link up with us is our international expertise. So we've uh, worked with practices in the US, we've worked with practices in Australia, in Canada, in the UK, across Europe, in the Middle East, even as far as China. Um, you know, we've applied the systems and processes that we've learned uh, by listening and systematically applying trial and error processes to the point where we develop a blueprint that actually works. And we've applied that in a lots of different variety of uh, situations, regardless of, you know, market. And I think that's one of the things that also holds up to some sense of reliability that you can trust that wherever you are in the world, there's a really good chance that we've done what you've done and what we do can apply to improve what you do where you are. Yeah, absolutely. And finally, I think something that's really important to us is that we believe in mutual fit. And you know, that a lot of people say that, a lot of platitudes, you know, going back and forth about that. But really, we we know now which practices are going to succeed with Lipsy Solar and which ones won't. And so we tell people right off the bat and the number one attribute that we're looking for in an ideal client for us is the courage and, and the readiness to succeed. The readiness to understand that going up that summit, trying to, to approach that mountain and climbing that, that hill of actually building your practice, make no bones about it. It's not an easy thing and nothing in life worth going after is easy, but you need to find a partner who can work with you and tell you the truth that it's not easy, but that, that you know, we'll go together. So we see ourselves very much as the guide and as the guide, we're gonna 
tell you the truth. If your ideas that you bring to us are bad, we'll tell you. Maybe the next day they're good, but we are not yes men. We will tell you exactly where you stand. And that's really what people are looking for when they come to us. They want a partner. They don't want uh, somebody to give an order to. They want a partner. So we very much um, appreciate and our clients appreciate the partnership approach that we take to build um, their practice together. So I'd say that, that, that that's probably the most common things that we hear that make Livesey Solar a, a unique marketing partner to work with a clinic to help them succeed. So now it's your turn. Uh, we've told you a little bit about us. We'd love to hear a little bit more about you. And what we offer uh, for that purpose is a 15 minute compatibility call. If you'd like to give us a ring, we can set that call up really easily and you can have a conversation with one of us and uh, discover whether or not you and us fit together. Yeah, look forward to chatting with you soon. Are you ready or considering taking your practice to the next level? If you are, then I've got a simple 15 minute exercise for you. The best thing for you to do is to have a chat. Uh, what we'll do is we'll figure out exactly where you are, what your challenges are, where you'd like to get to. And at the end of that, I'll be able to really clearly let you know if there are some things that we believe that at a world-class level, you're leaving on the table. So nothing ventured, nothing gained. Find out if you're leaving money on the table and if there's things that you can do in the next two years to double your practice. I look forward to meeting you.